Proteorc is a free web-based tool for proteomic data analysis. It accepts protein files from Proteome Discoverer and MAXQ UANT for analysis. Proteorc provides four sections, including labeled, label-free, differential expression, and data visualization. Label-free data. If the user has an intensity of peptide and wants to do protein quantification, user can choose the corresponding option. If not, they will be redirected to the protein grouping page, which will work the same as labeled data analysis. Step 1. Choose the method for quantification. IBAC or TOP3. Enter the enzyme that is used for protein digestion in sample preparation. Upload the reference sequence file that was used for PD or max quant during the database search, and also need to select the source of the file I. A. If the FASTA file is from RefSec database, select NCBI, or if it was downloaded from Uniprot, select Uniprot. Provide minimum and maximum length of peptides and missed cleavage, same as in the PD slash MAXQ, ANT search. Input data type, technical or biological replicate. Step three, provide the details on the number of test samples, control, and biological replicates of user data. Step four, upload the input file in any of the given formats, CSUV, TSUV, and XLSX, and click Submit. Step five, drag and drop each of the replicates in the corresponding containers. If the file contains three biological replicates, all the first, second, and third labeled biological replicates of the sample should drag and drop into the corresponding containers in the test sample section. Similarly, drag and drop the control samples also. Click on the next button after grouping the samples in batches. Step 6. Users can choose normalization methods SUM, Quantilile, IRS normalization, Z-score, and trimmed mean of M values. Users can delete the contaminants by selecting Remove Contaminants and can see the list of contaminants by downloading it. If the file does not contain a gene symbol, Protoarc provides an option for conversion of protein accession to gene symbol for further analysis. Click Next. Then, users can rename samples. It is not mandatory, but the name provided in this section will consider as sample names for further analysis, and click Submit. Step 8. Based on the user's choice of normalization method data will be normalized and represented using PCA analysis and box plot. If the experiment is a biological replicate user has the option to perform the batch correction, Protoarc provides two methods for batch correction, Combat and Lima. Batch corrected data will be represented using a box plot. Step 9 in differential expression analysis, we provide options for p value and fold change calculation. Proteorc provides LIMA, R package, implemented by DOCKER, for differential expression analysis. The significant cutoff value for fold change and p value can be given by the user, and it is used to identify the differentially expressed proteins in the analysis. The result page provides a bar chart to represent the proteins that are upregulated and downregulated in every sample. The users can download the full result that includes normalization and differential expression, calculation, and the file which contains only the differentially expressed proteins separately. In CSV format, Volcano Plot is provided for each sample control comparison in the analysis. The significant cutoff value used to plot the volcano is the value given by the user on the previous page. Heat map represents the fold change of statistically significant proteins that are differentially expressed in one or more samples. Select the cluster map for the hierarchical clustering heat map and K means for K mean cluster heat map. The color bar of the heat map is customized in such a way that the upregulated proteins will be in red and downregulated proteins in green. If the protein does not have differential expression in a sample, it will be in black. Step 10, Gene Ontology, KEG Pathway, STRING Analysis. User can perform gene ontology on the differentially expressed proteins in Proto-ORC. Users can select the p-value threshold for the same. Gene ontology results will be represented using a circular bar plot. Users can also download the entire result for the same. 
user can view all the KEGB pathways of the differentially expressed genes. These genes will be highlighted in color in the pathway image. Using StringDebby API Proteoric will display the protein-protein interaction for differentially expressed genes. Labeled data. Step 1. Select the input data type, technical or biological replicate. Step 2. Provide the details on the number of test samples control and biological replicates of user data. Step three, upload the input file in any of the given formats, CSUV, TSV, and XX, and click Submit. Step four, drag and drop each of the replicates in the corresponding containers. If the file contains three biological replicates, all the first, second, and third labeled biological replicates of the samples should drag and drop into the corresponding containers in the test sample section. Similarly, Drag and drop the control samples also. Need click on the next button after grouping the samples in batches. Step 5. Users can choose normalization methods sum, quantile, IRS normalization, z-score, and trimmed mean of m values. Users can delete the contaminants by selecting remove contaminants and can see the list of contaminants by downloading it. If the file does not contain a gene symbol, ProtoArc provides an option for conversion of protein accession to gene symbol for further analysis. Click Next. Step 7, based on the user's choice of normalization method data, will be normalized and represented using PCA analysis and box plot. If the experiment is a biological replicate user has the option to perform the batch correction. ProtoArc provides two methods for batch correction. Combat and Lemma. Batch corrected data will be represented using a box plot. Step 8, in differential expression analysis, we provide options for p-value and fold change calculation. Proteorc provides LIMAR package, implemented by DOCKER for differential expression analysis. The significant cutoff value for fold change and p-value can be given by the user, and it is used to identify the differentially expressed proteins in the analysis. The result page provides a bar chart to represent the proteins that are upregulated and downregulated in every sample. The users can download the full result that includes normalization and differential expression calculation and the file which contains only the differentially expressed proteins separately. In CSV format, Volcano Plot is provided for each sample control comparison in the analysis. The significant cutoff value used to plot the volcano is the value given by the user on the previous page. Heat map represents the full change of statistically significant proteins that are differentially expressed in one or more samples. Select a hierarchical cluster for the hierarchical clustering heat map and K means for K-mean cluster heat map. The color bar of the heat map is customized in such a way that the upregulated proteins will be in red and downregulated proteins in green. If the protein does not have differential expression in a sample, it will be in black. Step 9, Gene Ontology KEGG pathway, STRING analysis. User can perform gene ontology on the differentially expressed proteins in Proteorc. Users can select the p-value threshold for the same. Gene ontology results will be represented using a circular bar plot. Users can also download the entire result for the same. User can view all the KEGB pathways of the differentially expressed genes. These genes will be highlighted in color in the pathway image. Users can download pathway images in PNG format. Using StringDebby API Proteorc will display the protein-protein interaction for differentially expressed genes.